Learn how to set up and play Nintendo 3DS games in any iOS device like iPhones and iPads without any computer or jailbreak. Launch the App Store and search for Folium, which is the only Nintendo 3DS emulator available on Apple App Store. Although it is paid, but you can still try it, and if you still do not like it, you can get full refund by visiting this website, reportaproblem.apple.com, as shown on the video. So once you have sideloaded Folium using any of the mentioned methods, just launch Folium once. The first thing we require is to import the AES underscore keys file. The format of the file would be TXT format, which is necessary to run the 3DS games. I cannot show from where to get the file, but you can search yourself in Google. You either get the AES keys file ready to download in TXT format, like you see in the video, or you get to a website where it will give you a bunch of random numbers and letters as shown on the screen. All you have to do is copy the entire thing and then launch the notes app. Now please watch the following steps carefully, otherwise Folium will crash if the steps are done incorrectly. Create a new note, now, just press the return key, once or twice, until the cursor length is shortened. Once shortened it, just go back to the first line of the notes, and then paste the entire thing here. Next tap on the share icon, and tap on, save to files app. Now we will rename it to, AES, underscore, keys. The entire file name must be in lowercase letters. Do not make any error with the name. And that's it. Save it to any location. Now let's launch the Folium app and tap on AES underscore keys and next tap on import. Locate that exported file or the file you downloaded from the internet. Tap on the file and alas. We have successfully imported the AES keys text file to Folium. Next, to load the 3DS games, head over to the Files app. When you download 3DS games, it may be in either zip format or 7z format. To extract the zip file, just tap on it. And in case of 7z format files, just rename the file and change the format from 7z to zip. Just tap on, use zip option. Once renamed, simply tap on the file to extract it as well. If you require any assistance relating to this tutorial, just reach out to me directly, all the important links will be in description. Keep in mind that the format of the games must be in .3ds format only. Now, copy or move the actual extracted game file to the Folium folder. Inside the Folium folder, navigate to the Citrus folder and next paste the file to the ROM folder. I have placed these two extracted games file here. Once done, go back to the Folium app, if the game do not appear here, just swipe up, to bring the app switcher, and remove Folium from the switcher. Next, relaunch the Folium app, and as you can see, we have successfully loaded the 3DS games. Unfortunately I cannot show the gameplay, as Nintendo was seen flagging videos, showing their gameplays. The game is actually running smoothly, without any stuttering, or lagging. I hope you liked this video. If you want to learn how to install Scarlet without computer or sideload any IPA permanently without revokes, watch the next two videos.